We all have that annoying friend who's good at everything. Hi. And sometimes it feels like it would take multiple lifetimes to master a skill that comes so naturally to them. Many actors spend years under the finest tutelage to fully understand their craft. But for these lucky few, all they had to do was show up. Here are 10 actors who never took an acting course. I think this just might be my masterpiece. Brad Pitt. Brad Pitt is a Hollywood kingpin. An Oscar-winning actor, advocate, producer, and dad, Pitt is used to balancing a full plate. While he always maintained an interest in acting, he went to school for journalism before moving to California to pursue it as a career. He got lucky and after a handful of small roles, exploded into the superstar we know today. Pitt's been a part of some pretty intimidating ensemble casts like Ocean's Eleven, Snatch, and Inglorious Bastards. Despite the overwhelming star power surrounding him, he's often the standout and usually ends up being everyone's favorite character. Sound good? Yes, sir! It's like that perfume that you love that you can't stop smelling even when there's something sour in it. Jennifer Lawrence. Easily the most down-to-earth actress of all time, Jennifer Lawrence is the type of person you want to be friends with. She's humble, hilarious, and isn't afraid to be a real human in an unforgiving industry. The actress was spotted by an agent while out with her mom, and from there her career began a steady trajectory to where it is today. Lawrence has proven herself across a ton of genres, but her turn as Katniss Everdeen in the Hunger Games franchise took her already thriving career and pushed it right over the top. Oh! Oh! Okay. Eyes on me. Chris Pratt. Where would we be as a society if Chris Pratt wasn't in the spotlight making us laugh? Thanks to Ray Don Chong, we don't know. Since breaking out with NBC's Parks and Rec, Pratt has become a superstar. And he's so downright talented that he must have a master's in comedy. Probably from the most prestigious school in the land, right? Nope. Unlike the many of his Parks and Rec co-stars, the actor has zero formal acting training. He was living on the beach in Hawaii and was discovered by Chong while waiting tables at Bubba Gum Shrimp. Okay. Good. Whatever doesn't kill you simply makes you a stranger. Heath Ledger. Heath Ledger knew what he wanted, and straight out of high school, he went and took it. Known for his legendary performance as the Joker in Christopher Nolan's The Dark Knight, <laughs> Ledger was an incredible talent and is the only actor to be awarded a posthumous Oscar for the role. Before his passing in 2008, the actor received much praise for his work as Ennis Del Mar in Brokeback Mountain, captured everyone's heart as William in A Knight's Tale, and he did it all without one iota of training. Huh, talk about being naturally gifted. Tom Cruise Mr. Tom Cruise has been a staple in Hollywood since the 80s, and a quick peek at his resume will reveal a bevy of action-packed blockbusters. It's obvious that the iconic actor was made for the big screen. Well, obvious to everyone, except for him. That's easy for you to say. Growing up, Cruz was a very religious person and was actually on track to become a priest. And while his sermons would have been nothing short of Oscar-worthy, no one else has ever had the star power to ruin Oprah's couch and get away with it. Joaquin Phoenix. Joaquin Phoenix comes from a family of performers. Phoenix and his four siblings began acting when they were kids. So while he's never technically taken a class, the actor has been studying his whole life. Phoenix has taken on some of the most interesting roles to hit the big screen, with each one being radically different from the next. It's bigger than the both of us. You're making this shit up. You missed this shit up. He's been nominated for three Academy Awards. He occasionally recedes from the public eye, but always returns in spectacular fashion. The actor is one of the most versatile performers Hollywood has ever seen, and according to his IMDb page, he's not quitting anytime soon. <laughs> Rosario Dawson. Rosario Dawson didn't grow up wanting to be an actress. She actually had her sights set on marine biology. But fate intervened and Dawson was cast in 1995's Kids after being discovered while sitting outside her home. She's since gone on to work on over 60 projects and is a prime example of someone being in the right place at the right time. With two Sin City movies under her belt, the actress has proven she can handle herself in a fight. And since the 2015 release of the Daredevil TV franchise, audiences have been following her evolution as Claire Temple all across Netflix, occasionally popping up in Luke Cage and Jessica Jones as well. Aziz Ansari. 
Like his Parks and Rec co-star Chris Pratt, Aziz Ansari showed up on the scene without one acting class to his name. But that doesn't mean he doesn't have a degree. The comedian graduated with a major in marketing from the NYU Stern School of Business. A natural showman, Ansari has found a way to mix his love of human behavior with his comedy in a hilarious, relatable way. And we're willing to bet that all those presentations he had to do as a business student helped him with his public speaking. Plus, if anyone could take Entertainment 720 and make it work for real, it's him. This is Gerard Butler. Given his bad boy attitude, you'd think Gerard Butler grew up aiming for a career on the edge. His life may be badass now, but the actor is actually a lawyer by training. After getting his law degree, Butler ended up in California. After a rough couple of months, he says he decided to hang up his robes and become an actor instead. He's a natural, too. But tonight, we died in hell! When we watch him run from an explosion or punch someone in the face, it feels just right. And while the legal profession is a noble one, when it comes to rescuing President Aaron Eckert, Gerard Butler is the only man for the job. Are you ready, Mr. President? What we do in life? Echoes in eternity. Russell Crowe. Some people go to school so they can have a leg up when it comes time to apply for a job. But in Hollywood, it's all about who you know. Russell Crowe's parents were movie caterers, and his grandfather was a cinematographer. So the actor had more exposure to the business than most when he decided to become a part of it. Crowe's acting chops have been on display for years now, but his turn as Maximus in 2000's Gladiator is what made him a household name. Crowe's lack of training hasn't held him back in the slightest, and in 2017, audiences will get to see his take on the legendary character of Dr. Jekyll in The Mummy. What do you think of our list? Are you not entertained? Did we miss any of your favorite actors with no training? Tell us about them in the comments below and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more great videos like this one. Thanks for watching.